All right, old man. Yeah. Oh, oh my God. <laughs> what the? Nice. What the hell? I know what you're thinking. How the hell did I get myself in this situation again? Well, I guess if we're gonna find out, we're gonna have to go back, back to uh, 1977. Now we've come back this far because I like to reminisce. Look, that's me, a young Joe. Handsome back then I was. I was a security guard and I was good at what I did. But something shocked me that day. You see, they killed all my friends. I wandered the halls of that place for years, sad and alone and didn't know what to do. Until one day, a miracle happened. Baby Frank! I knew from the very first moment I laid eyes on him, we'd become best friends. We exercised and he taught me sit-ups and he slept with me and he grew and I got old. And then one day I stole him and took him home to meet Martha. Hey Martha, I'd like you to meet our new son, Frank. Oh my God, it just gets worse. Martha loved me very much, and I loved her. You're scum! Her favorite game was hide and seek, and some days it used to take weeks to find her. Oh, she was so good at hiding. But one day she ate so good, I couldn't find her. Oh, Frank, I looked for 17 years and realized that I could only report it after 24. And it was while watching an episode of Columbo, I had an epiphany. This was the man I needed to find to help me look for Martha. I mean, Columbo's good. He can solve a crime even want. before it's happened. Uh, I'd best get down to the city and find him. You guys escape from the seniors' home, or? Oh no, I'm uh, I, I live out at Sandy Shore. I'm down here looking for my uh, my wife. Did you did you bike all the way down here? Your wife? Yeah, she's been missing now. What's coming on seventeen years? Seventeen years? Yeah, I made the mistake. I was told I had to wait twenty four. I mistook that for twenty four years before I had to report it. Oh, that's, that's twenty four hours. I know, I know that now. After a young officer spoke to me yesterday. Jeez. Yeah, you could it's it's like a cold case now. Oh, uh, don't say that. Uh, she was cold to start with, See, you know. I I know the best detective in the city. Okay. Yeah, Columbo. Right. No, well, I mean, I was I was gonna say Brad. Brad, Brad you, Columbo. You, you 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 go you go offer Brad Foreman a chicken nuggy and he'll find your wife. Brad Foreman, chicken nuggy. Yeah. Is that all one? Is that his whole name? And we start yeah. with this. No, Brad Foreman is his name. I, Chicken Nuggy is what you're going to need. Chicken Nuggy is what I'm going to need. Well, let's have a try this uh, medicine this uh, biker gave me. It's going to be good for me arthritis. <laughs> it stinks a bit. Whoa! This ain't normal. 
What the hell's going on? I feel really great. I feel like a teenager again. Oh, wow, this is absolutely... Oh, I don't feel so well. Oh. Oh. Is this the shooting victim? Yeah. Uh, yes. Oh my god, there's a big penguin by me. What the hell? There's two of them. Hello, penguins. Well, Same. okay. I see. Seems like you're hallucinating. Oh, is that an angel above me? Oh, it's the He's angel of death. The penguin. Ah, the angel of death. That's the last time I take any medicinal medicine from a greasy biker. My God, I never had a stomach pump before. My God, I don't want to go through that ever again. Hey, so where's Brad? Hey. Hey, is that Officer Brad? You want to hop in with us? Yeah, well, all right, Officer Brad. Yeah, I've been looking for you. Fucking Harry. No, no, huh? what? no. That's not Harry. No, Who is that? It's Joe. Who? Who? Joe. Joe. Yeah, you're not Brad. No, I'm not fucking Brad. All right, I gotta speak to Officer Brad. Give him a chicken nookie. Is that okay. is that Officer Brad? I don't know. Am I still hopping in or not? I mean, if you get want to, we can take car. you to Pete. Get in the car right now. Yeah, just get in the car. All right, I'll get we'll, in. We'll help you. Yeah, Officer Brad. I'm looking for my wife, Martha. You're looking for your wife, Martha? Yeah, she's been missing 17 years, but apparently I should have reported it after 24 hours. I thought they said 24 years. Oh. Huh? Yeah, she's, well. she's good at hide and seek. Normally I find her around the neighbor's house. Find her at the neighbor's house. That's where I last found her. She was missing for six weeks and she was under the neighbor's bedclothes. Well, I am. Yeah, she's good at hide and seek. She's the best. Really? So, uh, you have any relatives in town or? No, I am. Well, apart from Martha. Just... No, I live my. I'm from Sandy Shore. I cycled down here. Took me, uh, about four weeks. Did you bike the whole way here? Yeah. After we get our piece, we're gonna go to the Where are you going? Whee! I said, okay, <laughs> I'll go get a band aid. Are you having fun, buddy? Oh, man. Best fun I've had yes. ever. So you just arrived yesterday, huh? In the city, yeah. It was a long cycle ride. I've been looking, looking for Martha. Thank you, Ailey. Yeah. Looking for Martha. Yeah, I scoured uh, all around Sandy. You know, for the last 17 years. So I thought I'd come down in huh. the city. And you rode your bicycle all the way? Yeah, and then I was going to leave in another... Well, uh, up to 24 years before I reported to the police that she was missing. Well, you know, I got the That's... hours and years all mixed up. Oh, well, they're the same difference, right? Yeah, you know, as it's time flies. Hi, we here. Yeah, the bank. Yeah, I needed to make a withdrawal. Yeah. Hey, I need to check my balance as well. See, see if Martha's been using it. Well, oh, that's a wazer. That's some crazy driving right there. I know, right? No, still got all my millions. All right, old man. Yeah. Oh, oh my God. <laughs> what, the, what the hell? And that's how I wound up on the floor on my knees in a bank on a cold floor with these nice folks. They said if they'd hold me at gunpoint, 
Officer Brad would come to me. I like him. These people are nice. So what, got, what brings you guys to do this? Ah, uh, you know, just, just need some money. All right, Grandpa Joe, I'm gonna have a good hand stand up for me. Hands up. All right, okay. Okay, right, hold on. Um, there we go. I got it. Got it. Up. Got it. All right, we just gotta keep communication, sir, so we don't have no accidents. All right, whenever whenever he comes out, he's gonna he's gonna go to the right. If you to the right of me, he's gonna go to the right, my right, and then we're gonna get in the cars and then we're gonna go. Hold on. All right. We're just waiting on you guys to come out. All right, give us give us a few more seconds. They say they're coming out a little bit. Yeah, All right, Grandpa, start, start walking towards the door. Okay, right on. You're going, you're right, going to go to the right. Come out to the right to me. I'll take you. Come with me. Okay. Come with me. Come with me. Come with me. Follow me. Follow me. Right, that tight squeeze. Follow me. Okay. 10-4, I have the hostage. I have the hostage. All right, sir, you can put your hands down, but I am going to have to search you for your safety and mine as well. Yeah, no, that's that's uh, that's fine enough, sir. Okay, thank you, sir. Oh, that was uh, pretty exciting. I, 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 I must admit. They said it was a All right, do you need medical or anything, sir? No, no, they uh, they, they, they picked me up because they said they wanted to, I was just up to see Officer Brad, and they said they'd take me to him. I, I thought it was a rather elaborate idea to get him to come to me like this. I mean, I was going to him. Why they think he was going to bring him to me doing this? I ain't got a clue. Okay. Sorry, I'm sorry, just looking around. Making sure nobody comes up behind us. Yeah, no, I, I, I understand. I, I watch enough Columbo. <laughs> Fair enough. Yeah, I guess. Um, so where did they get you from? Uh, yeah, I was uh, at uh, that big park uh, on my uh, motorcycle push bikey thing, and uh, I was off to see, not far away from the police station, to see Officer Brad, and he picked me up there. And then we drove around town for like seemed like uh, twenty minutes, you know. And then, okay. uh, and then we come here, and I said, "All right, uh, the bank. I check my bank account, make sure Martha's not stolen any of my money." And, and then he said that it was a it was an elaborate idea to get Officer Brad to come to me. And then, uh, then, 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 then the guns came.